Well, it's a good question. I think it's a human rights violations. The worst thing is that uh, we face that as a, as a criminal uh, issue. Death penalty or mass incarceration or the problems with poverty and uh, vulnerable groups. Well, when, whenever you take any extreme, either it's totally liberal market or on the other hand, uh, uh, extreme prohibition, you always create uh, more harms. We have seen that regretfully, I mean, the drug issues um, hamper the overall sustainable development. This is an issue of health and it has to come back to, to, to health again. Well, I mean, uh, evidently the individuals and the dependency on drugs is a major, major problem. Um, aquellas políticas uh, de drogas que no reconocen los derechos eh, de los usuarios a, a consumir y por lo tanto eh, no eh, contemplan eh, el hecho del consumo en sí mismo y los riesgos que pues, se pueden estar tomando, eh, pueden estar apartando de un sistema eh, tanto de salud como de social a, a estas personas. There's so many harms that are being perpetuated uh, throughout the world and obviously it's just that we're creating a culture of violence around substance use and around substance production and around the trafficking and transit of, of these psychoactive plants uh, and substances and that then has a ripple effect of creating uh, harms around the world. Destabilized states like Afghanistan or, or, or Mexico where thousands of people die every year uh, and this is because of the uh, extreme harsh prohibition. The main problem is the how the justice system makes prohibition impact on the people who is or more compromised with the change or the more uh, poverty. Honestly I'm not so much into laws and uh, drug policies uh, but Yes, of course, there should be some more uh, issues about prevention. Uh, and we need to look at both. I mean, there is the individual aspect, which is dramatic by itself, but add to that as well, I mean, the uh, um, aspects of uh, development and especially sustainable development. Everything is ruled by violence rather than being ruled by uh, by regulations that allow us to know, uh, have information about the substance, to know what we're consuming if we choose to consume, uh, to have education if we don't want to consume. Um. But drug policies <laughs> is a tricky question actually.